Hey guys back with another video from my addicted blogging channel and in this video I will be discussing about how we can activate dual whatsapp with the same number in the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 and in our phone and definitely the same number whatsapp if activated will solve a lot of issues with the whatsapp in the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4. The first issue which it will solve is we will be able to use the full whatsapp via this watch and also it will solve a very very important problem that is we don't need to take out our phone to see what whatsapp message we have received we can see it directly from the watch and also we will be able to reply to messages via the whatsapp on this watch so definitely this will be a very very important video if you are into using whatsapp in the samsung galaxy watch 4 and this will help you to use your Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 in a whole different way than you use your regular smart watches. So definitely this will be a sick video guys and if you are taken to sales don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because I will be making more videos like this. So first of all the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 is a great watch and we can now use the WhatsApp in this watch. Not only we can use the WhatsApp but we can also configure the same whatsapp in the samsung galaxy watch 4 and in our phone that means the messages which we will be receiving via whatsapp in our phone will be directly available on this watch and not only it will be directly available we will be able to reply to those messages from this watch we will be able to use the full whatsapp on this smartwatch and definitely we can not only reply but we can send voice messages we can call the other person we can also send emoticons files and whatever we will do in whatsapp we can do it all via this watch so the best way to configure the same whatsapp in our phone and in the samsung galaxy watch 4 is via the whatsapp web so we all know that the whatsapp web is one of the most important features of whatsapp via which we can log in into the whatsapp via our desktop or laptop without even downloading the whatsapp app and that feature we will be using in here to log in into the whatsapp in our samsung galaxy watch 4 so for this we don't need to download the whatsapp app in our samsung galaxy watch 4 but we will be using the whatsapp web feature which is available in there and we will log into the whatsapp web by using the browser in this watch so the first step we need to do to activate the same whatsapp is download a good browser in this watch via which we can log into the whatsapp web so I will recommend you to download the Google Chrome browser which is available in the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 and it is super easy to install this browser in this watch. The first thing you need to do is download a few apps which will enable you to install this browser. Obviously the first app which you need to install to install the Google Chrome browser is the Easy Fire Tools and this app will enable you to install any third party app. So after you install this app you need to download the Google Chrome browser apk and to download this apk you need to come to a specific link i will be leaving the link of this in the description so after you have downloaded the browser you have to again come to easy fire tools and once you are in the easy fire tools you need to connect this with the watch so once you have connected it to the watch you need to come to custom apk file select the google chrome apk which you have downloaded in there and once you have selected the apk you need to just click on this install option to get the google chrome installed in the samsung galaxy watch 4 so once you have installed the google chrome you want to just fire it on this watch and once you fire it you want to open the whatsapp web on this watch so to open the whatsapp web you just need to type the whatsapp web in the google chrome browser and click on the stick sign and that will take you to the search results for whatsapp web and once you see this whatsapp web option you need to click on there and it will definitely go to the whatsapp web on this google chrome in this smartwatch so once you are there you need to perform some of the specific actions which will take you to the whatsapp web 
in this watch so the first thing you need to do is click on these three dots and go to the desktop version because the whatsapp web only works on the desktop version and is meant to be used via the google chrome in your laptop or desktop you have to go to the desktop version of this website and once you go to the desktop version you will see the whatsapp web will load and show you the qr code which is required to log in to the whatsapp web via this watch so you can see finally the qr code has been loaded in the google chrome in this watch and definitely you will see the qr code will be visible via the browser so after that you need to open the whatsapp in your phone and click on link a device and that will definitely open the qr scanner which will scan the qr code so the issue with this is you will see that although the qr code has loaded in this watch it will not be able to detect it because the qr code is not visible properly because of the resolution in this watch so we have forcefully installed the google chrome in this watch and definitely the google chrome is not meant to work on this small little screen of samsung galaxy watch 4 for which the text and the qr code is not visible properly so we need to just decrease the resolution or the density so that the qr code will be visible in this small little screen of the samsung galaxy watch 4 and to do this we need to perform again some of the steps which will help us to see the full qr code via the browser so the next thing which we need to do is install the bug jagger app which will help us to decrease the density in this watch so after you have installed this you need to open the app and you need to click on this connect symbol and give the ip address in here so to get the ip address you have to come to the settings of this watch and once you are in the settings you need to come to the developer options and once you are in the developer option you need to enable adb debugging and also the wireless debugging option and here you will get the ip address which you need to put in here and also the port number will be 5555 so once you have done this you want to just click on the connect option so once i click on the connect option you will see it will take some time to connect it to the watch and once it gets connected you will be able to decrease the screen density of the samsung galaxy watch 4 so again i will open the google chrome in here and you can see the QR code is not visible properly so I need to come to this interactive shell option and here run some commands to decrease the density in this watch so the command to decrease the density is WM density 200 so this is the command which you need to type in here and once you type in here you need to click on the play button so I just run the command in here and clicked on the play button and this has decreased the density of the samsung galaxy watch 4 and you can see the icons have become a lot smaller than before and now if i open the google chrome you will be able to see that the website of whatsapp web will load again and it will be able to show me the full qr code which is available for my whatsapp so here you can see it is still loading and it will be showing the qr code in here so it will take some time to get the qr code for my whatsapp so finally after decreasing the screen density the qr code is loaded and you can see the qr code is visible now properly and i will just come to the whatsapp wave option in my phone and scan the qr code on this watch so after it got scanned you can see it is logging in the whatsapp in my watch and it has scanned the QR code for my whatsapp and it is taking some time to load the whatsapp wave on this watch so finally you can see the whatsapp wave has loaded in my watch and i can see all my messages on my watch itself so let's see whether we are able to reply to any of the messages in here so here i am into one of the chats and you can see i am able to read all the chats in there and also i will be able to share any messages and also if we want we can send smileys we can also send the documents up there whatever we will be able to do via the whatsapp web in our phone 
we will be able to do it via the words itself so definitely this is a really good solution if you are looking for something which will enable you to use the whatsapp on our phone and also on the smartwatch so that we don't need to take our phone every time we receive a message or to reply or send documents or send smileys we can do everything via the samsung galaxy watch 4 itself you can see every little option is there in the whatsapp wave and this will entirely change the way we use whatsapp in our samsung galaxy watch 4 and how we look into these smart watches so that's it guys i just wanted to show you how we can configure the same whatsapp in the samsung galaxy watch 4 and in our phone and this is now possible by doing some of the steps in there so i hope you have liked this video if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel hit that bell notification icon because i will be making more videos like this thank you guys have a great day thank you